Hey Jay, how you doing? Okay, uh, I cleared the board because I wanted to give us a fresh perspective on this statistical question that we had started working with, which is how much money did you make on Saturday? So again, statistical question because it can be answered by a bunch of different people in a bunch of different ways, all truthfully, as opposed to a question like, who was the first president of the United States, which you better answer George Washington or else you're probably wrong, right? Okay, so these four numbers were given by four different people about how much money they earned on Saturday. And notice that, that remember, we call this a data set. And we have ordered the data from smallest to largest. We found the range by subtracting 90 minus 20 is 70. And now we've been working with the median. And we found that that median value, let's open up a new pen. We found that the median value, this pen doesn't work. Let's try it. Let's open up a pen that works. How about, how about a nice red pen that actually works? Let's try that. Okay. We found that the median value equals, we said 55, right? I'll just keep the dollar signs off. 55 is our number. Re represents $55. Okay. This is one measure of center. Measure of center. Okay. And so that is one way to think about the middle of this set, measure of center. Now there's another way of measuring or finding a measure of center, and that is called the mean, and we talked about that a little bit. And because I see a little thing here, I'm going to make a little adjustment again to these numbers, okay? So what I'm going to do is I'm going to change this highest value. I'm going to bring it up to $110. How does that sound? Hopefully that won't. Now notice what happened when I changed this value. It turns out this guy made more money than he thought. So it doesn't change the median because these two middle values are still the same. They're unchanged and the median is still 55. Now we want to find the mean of these values, which is what is thought of as the average. Like if you wanted to average out, if you wanted to divide up all this money and then redistribute it evenly, how much money would everybody get? And the way to do that is we had a little work with that before. 20 plus 27 plus 83 plus 110. So I'm taking all these numbers and then I'm dividing by four. Why did I choose four? Because there's four people, there's four values involved. So I add up four values, I divide it by four. Now what happens when I do that? I get, how much do I get? I get 110. You could do this on your calculator or you could do this 110, I'll do this all 83, 27, and 20. Let's just do this the old fashioned way. Zero, carry the one, 10. That is a four. 240. Does that seem right? 240? It is right. Okay. We're taking 240, and now we're going to divide that by four. So 240 divided by four. And that's not so bad. That equals 60. And so it turns out that the mean of this data set, this somewhat changed data set, is now 60, okay? So you could do that for any data set. To find the median, you find the middle value, and if you need to, you take the mean average of the two middle numbers. And to find the mean, you just add up all the numbers and then divide by the number of values in the data set. And so now we have two measures of center, two measures of center, the median is 55 and the mean is 60. Okay, and we'll take a look at some other ideas in the next video.